He's a human. The Hall of Famer is here! Officially underway. Oh, that was a hard shot. Connects with the title. And let me tell you, that thing is heavy. Connects with the title. And let me tell you, that thing is heavy. Second time's a charm. And let me tell you, that thing is heavy. Cut X with the championship. Oh man, that one landed square too. If an opponent had cut X with the championship. Oh man, that one landed square too. Going for it again. Going to the well and cut X with the championship. Oh man, that one landed square too. The frequency of this move is becoming deliberate at this point, to say the least. His clothesline finds the mark. Now watch this. Northern in luck. Plenty of fight left. Too soon. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Ouch. Smart move. AJ Styles with a nice reversal. Edge has been called the ultimate opportunist, and it's a nickname he's earned by using some unique methods to earn titles in main event matches. You say unique, I say innovative. Edge was the first Money in the Bank winner, and he picked the best possible time to cash in. If not for him, we'd have folks going the John Cena route and declaring their cash in ahead of time. Driven back down to the mat with unbelievable power AJ Styles guys he's setting up for something here looking to take out the leg this might be it guys oh man Edge doesn't even know where he is whoa he gets out of it he's at another level right now Michael he gets him with a reversal oh he's such a tough target what a reversal by AJ Styles Styles is always thinking neck breaker Guys, the most important thing for a superstar to remember in a Falls Count Anywhere match is that anything goes. And I do mean anything. I hope someone uses you as a weapon, Saxton. The flying forearm finds his target. Bringing it back between the ropes. As Byron mentioned, anything goes in this one, which means we're likely to see a liberal use of weaponry here tonight. Yeah, and keep in mind, Cole, the fact that there's no disqualification also means that anybody can interfere and there's nothing you can do about it. A sickening thud as he lands hard. AJ Styles may have it. Styles clash! Wow, let's see that again. Man, he is simply a walking highlight reel. You can never count AJ Styles out, but a few losses of note are coming from bigger opponents who counted Styles' aerial attack. And if you're going to beat Styles, you need a strong move. Roman Reigns barely escaped their rivalry, but he got two big wins with some well-timed spears. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Smart move. Whoa, did you see what he just did? Incredible. Gosh, this is like that old battery commercial. This move just keeps going and going and going and going. To your point, Corey, I can think of another time strength stopped the phenomenal one. When John Cena rolled from an attitude adjustment into a second AA to win their classic match at the Alamo Dome. And you can't forget AJ's match against Brock Lesnar. Styles survived Suplex City, but fell to an F5. Beating Styles requires a lot of power and even more luck. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Exhibiting some amazing acrobatics. Well, guys, the referee should have it relative edge in a savage clothesline. 
Edge, he delivers a hard clothesline. Edge looking for the, the human body can only absorb so much of that. Edge looking for the victory here. AJ Styles is in trouble. You can say that again, Saxton, but I don't want to hear you talk. Might be too late for him, but don't tell him that. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Don't think that went as planned. Boy, that's the truth. Hard to argue your take on this match, Michael. When there are no rules to enforce, Styles Clash! The champ's in a real bad place right now. And the champ kicks out. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. He's going for it all. Whoa. Bad move there. I don't know what made him think that was a good idea. Surprises him with that drop kick. Real quick, in case we have any newbies watching, a false count anywhere match means that this contest can literally end anywhere. Simple, right? Even Saxton can understand those rules. Oh, man, he's going off here. I don't know if this is by design or if he connects with the championship. Oh, man, that one landed square, too. At this point, you think he'd have that move well scouted. I understand the idea of being relentless, but I think most would agree repeating a specific move is an unorthodox approach. Man, look at this. That's right, just keep going. In describing this match, Corey, you said it can end anywhere, which means we could see this match conclude in the ring, the stands, the locker room. Heck, and now Edge could have this match in the bag. Edge looking for the victory here. AJ Styles is looking to fly. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Toss to the outside. Real quick, in case we have any newbies watching, a false count. He's got him down. Is this it? And he manages to get the shoulder up. Not yet. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Up and over with a suplex. A sickening thud as his body is driven to the mat. Drops the elbow on him. Knocked off his feet. Now that's a takedown. In describing this match, Corey, you said it can end anywhere, which means we could see this match conclude in the ring, the stands, the locker room. Heck, it could even out end outside the streets. And on top of that, it's worth noting that anything is legal in this match, guys. The only rule is there are no rules. Lightning fast reflexes. An insane German suplex. with the championship. Oh, man, that one landed square, too. He clearly has confidence in that move. As a kid, Edge grew up in Toronto, Canada and was a huge WWE fan. Not only was he in the crowd at WrestleMania 6, but he won an essay contest in high school. The prize was training at a wrestling school by none other than Canadian legend Sweet Daddy Siki. Here we go again. It's the whack. Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. Try AJ Styles with a burst of energy. Well, growing up in Canada, Edge idolized people like WWE Hall of Famers, Mr. Perfect, Brett the Hitman Hart, Shawn Michaels, and Randy Macho Man Savage. I'm sure some of those names came up in his winning essay. Like many of us who enter sports entertainment, Edge did everything he could to watch WWE. Edge wanted to learn as much as possible about his favorite WWE superstars and one day follow in their footsteps. Here we go again. There he goes again. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Going for it again. To have the slightest chance of success against the rated R superstar, you have to keep your cool. Edge has so much experience and is such a talented competitor, he can use the smallest lapse in judgment against you. We've seen this before. It starts to feel like a broken record with that move. Over and over and over. We're seeing the same move being used. Breathtaking acrobatics on display here. To your point, Corey, a superstar must keep their composure when going up against the rated R superstar edge. This is a decorated champion. It becomes more dangerous in a match as this AJ Styles is setting it up. And once again, we see a return to this specific maneuver. Styles Clash! The champ's in a bad way now, Cole. With the elbow drop. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Smart move. 
When it comes to falls count anywhere matches, for my money, there are few better than the November 2016 battle between Charlotte Flair and Sasha Banks. There he goes again. He clearly oh, shows no mercy. In that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Man, look. Oh, shows no mercy. In that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. The frequency of this move is becoming deliberate at this point, to say the least. Connects with the title. And let me tell you, that thing is heavy. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. Speaking of that classic Charlotte Sasha encounter Corey mentioned, we should add that it was the first time ever that the Women's Championship changed hands in a Falls Count Anywhere match. And guys, I will never forget the image of Charlotte tapping out to that unique bank statement in the crowd surrounded by the WWE Universe. Well, man, he's going off here. I don't know if this is by design or if he just lost his mind. What a shot to the back. The Money in the Bank match and contract have been associated with some of the most thrilling moments in WWE history. It's important to remember that it began with the first Mr. Money in the Bank, and that was Edge after he won the first ever Money in the Bank ladder match at WrestleMania 21. A high-risk maneuver in the works from that top turnbuckle. Frog splash! Michael, that gives new meaning to have a seat. At this point, oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. The Money in the Bank match at WrestleMania 21 was something very different when it debuted in 2005. Edge is known as a master of ladder matches and was the odds on favorite. The rated R superstar made sure that contract led him to championship goals. Edge set a standard when he won the first Money in the Bank match at WrestleMania 21. But I don't think anyone could have anticipated just how sought after the Money in the Bank contract would become. Styles looks like he wants to do it all by himself. Obviously putting a lot of stock in that maneuver. And there it is again. There he goes again. And another one. I understand the idea of being relentless, but I think most would agree repeating a specific move is an unorthodox approach. Here we go again. Gosh, this is like that old battery commercial. This move just keeps going and going and going and going. And just like that, this move is leading the charge. Oh boy, he is rolling. The Impaler! Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Guys, the most important thing for a superstar to remember in a Falls Count Anywhere match is that anything goes. And I do mean anything. AJ Styles is getting ready. Snap suplex. Very Styles clash. Wow, that was awesome. It just doesn't appear to be Edge's night tonight. AJ Styles is rolling now. You gotta wear your opponent down. Find that Styles clash. It just doesn't appear to be Edge's night tonight. As Byron mentioned, anything goes in this one, which means we're likely to see a liberal use of AJ Styles may have it. Uh-oh, here it is. He goes for the cover. One, two, a kick out, and he almost had him. He is not going to go down without a fight, Michael. Edge has been called the Rated R Superstar, and it's a nickname he really embraced during his later career, where he became a more aggressive superstar with his opponents and, uh, well, a little romantic with Lita. Back in the ring again. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. The repetition. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Byron mentioned Edge's persona as the rated R superstar, and you need only to watch his hardcore brawls with McFoley to see how down and dirty Edge can get. As for what Byron called romantic, there's Edge and Lita's live celebration from 2006. Well, you're forgetting the key ingredient of the rated R superstar, and that's that goof Tony Chimmel's voice cracking every time he introduced Edge. Let's just say I'm happy JoJo did the ring announcing tonight. Uh-oh, shoulders down, championship on the line! During the Attitude Era, Edge was a member of the frightening trio known as The Brood. That unholy alliance spawned one of the greatest tag teams of all time. 
Edge and Christian helped revolutionize the TLC match and became Edge. There we go again. Going to the well again. The frequency of this move is becoming a powerful takedown. This one's over, guys. He clearly has confidence that we've got to cover. Edge became a master at forming championship teams and various partners. Things took a different turn when he became the rated R superstar and had epic rivalries with Ric Flair, DX, John Cena, and The Undertaker. As the rated R superstar, Edge cemented his legacy as an all-time great in sports entertainment. Over the course of his career, Edge won an amazing 31 championships between singles and tag team competition. What is keeping this competitor going? There is no quit in this man tonight. He's docking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Styles Clash! Can he finish him off here? After 18 years, people told AJ Styles he'd never We have a new champion. At this point, you think he'd have that move well scouted. Here we go again. Oh, man, he's going off here. I don't know if this is by design or if he just lost his mind. Oh, my goodness. Crushing it. That was just one of those matches that the men involved should just be proud to be a part of. A legendary performance. Dig down deep to pick up the win. Wow, when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that, you've done something right. And give this Houston crowd credit for being on their...